All right. Now we'll try for the awful Delfino Lily Pad ride. All right, you want banana? Mmm, <laughs> bananas. Mmm. And you know what? I'm even going to take the normal way there, just to show people how awful this... This is the absolute worst mission in the game. Like, it's not named, but... As far as singular shine sprites go, this is the worst. It doesn't get any worse than this. So we have Yoshi. That's great. What do we do with Yoshi? See that boat? We gotta ride that boat. For a very long time. Wow! Great! I love how the boat just kicks you off. That's great. And he wants another banana, because of course he does. Let's see if we can get the banana to the Yoshi and get on the boat before it goes back to the place in the canal. You usually take the sewer system near the boat. I guess that's another way of doing it. Oh, look, we just missed the boat. So you can either ride the boat to the island, or, um... Yoshi moves so weirdly through the sewers. So did I get rid of both the sponges in... Okay, camera? Camera. Camera. Yoshi moves so freaking annoyingly through the sewers. He's way slower than Mario in the sewers for some reason. Like, way slower. I think that one of these areas leads to another blue coin, actually. Yep. So yeah, you can take this... I forgot that there was a sewer system that led to this island. So while you're here, there's a bunch of different boats that can come here. Thankfully, there's a coconut tree here to replenish Yoshi's, Yoshi's juice. You're gonna need that. And in the meantime, we just wait. So that boat is not the one we want to get on. That'll bring us back that way. And we don't want that. That boat over there, that's the one we need to get on. And it is very, very, very slow. Your hand tastes good. Don't mind me, I'm just a Yoshi. I don't know about social norms or anything like that. <laughs> you can lick her all day, but if you spill even a little juicy juice on her, she freaks out. Spaghettios. <laughs> I can't see why she would be upset about this. Pick your own coconuts next time. Oh my gosh, it takes so long. DEPS alert. There's a Yoshi spraying juice on a woman's head on a remote island. 
So this is the boat we want to grab. I'll get on. Make sure you got a full set of juice. Oh, by the way, I turned off auto mod. Auto mod is off, so if... If you got your message, like, held by Automod, then Automod is literally lying to me, being like, I'm off. Don't worry. The boats move very slowly, but strangely just fast enough that it can be hard to jump on them sometimes. It would be one thing if you just had to do this to get a shine, but this isn't all you have to do. All of this takes you to a secret area, which is by far the worst secret area of the game. And if you fail at it, you have to do it all this boat nonsense again. This is one of those shines that I never bothered getting. Because it was just too dumb. I also love how th this area that we're going to has a single banana on top of it. Just to replenish Yoshi Yoshi's juice along the way. Okay. <laughs> that was way too close. Don't spin jump onto that platform. It takes you way too high. You can do a regular jump. DEBS alert. Somebody is joyriding on these self-driving boats. The shine sprites. Which had all but vanished in recent days are rapidly returning to their traditional gathering spot, the Shine Gate. In related news, a Yoshi has been destroying sponges. In other news, there's a new version of Jane Eyre in the offing. Wait, that's a gold bird. We can get the gold bird later. We have to melt this sponge, and welcome to the absolute worst shine sprite in the game. The Delfino Plaza lily pad ride. You thought the boat was bad? Oh, this is so, so much worse. So, we have to get on this lily pad, which controls, like, the boat. The difference is, though, uh, we have to collect red coins along the way. And eventually the water starts carrying us, so we have to go fast. And also, this was not water. This is poison, and if you touch even a little bit of it, you instantly die. How many lives do I have? Oh, I have 13 lives. Yep. This is why I stocked up on lives at Corona Mountain. Because I might need all of these. So we, what we really want to do is move as slowly through the water as possible. Okay. I don't think... The annoying thing is because the current is constantly pushing us, I don't think we can move backwards. for it now. It is possible to grab these without the lily pad. Who thought this was a good idea for a mission? Like, even the pachinko machine is not this bad. Which maybe some people disagree, but, um, no, pachinko machine is nowhere near this bad. I'm gonna just spray forwards to no. It, again, the lily pad is impossible to control.
I fully expect I'm gonna get a game over on this level. And have to do the entire stupid boat walk again. We are slowing our move forward. And yet, we still miss that stupid red coin. I'm convinced this is the intended way of doing it. Not to go on the lily pad, but to go on the edges. Yes, there is a warp pipe at the end. You think, oh, I take the warp pipe, I go back to the start of the level and can get the... No, 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 no. That warp pipe takes you back to Delfino Plaza, and you will have to take the boat ride again. No indication that that's what it does. Any reasonable person would think, oh, yeah, this will take me back to the start of the course, right? Nope. Mm -mm. No, no. I'm pretty sure the developers just wanted to make the most evil level possible. And they're like, hoo hoo. Because, like, not only... This secret alone would be the worst in the game already. But the fact that you have to take the ridiculously long Yoshi boat ride just to get here makes it so much worse. Alright, I gotta I gotta hover a little earlier on this part. Cause I always I I take too long to hover. Oh, that's like right barely above the swamp water. Darn you! I don't know how speedrunners can do this consistently. I don't- God, why is that red coin impossible to grab? Like, no matter where you spray, the lily pad will just careen you into the wall and you miss it. So no, you know what? I'm just gonna let the current take me there. If I miss that one, then I miss that one. I'll just grab whatever red coins I can grab, and then on the way back I'll try to pick up the remaining. If you go back to the start, do you get a new lily pad, I wonder? Probably not. That would be a mer an act of mercy, and there's no mercy in the lily pad ride. I, I think this might actually be the single worst challenge in any Mario game. I can't really think of anything worse. Oh, there is another lily pad up there. Like, I can't think of a level in a 2D Mario game, or a single collectible in a 3D Mario game, that is worse than this Shine Sprite right here. Really, the only mercy of this level is that it is optional. You don't have to grab it to beat the game. They even put these skull and crossbone signs here at the beginning, too. Come off it! No! You've got to be freaking... These two red coins are the absolute worst. This one in particular, because it's right above the swamp water. Mm. 
Forget the lily pad. The lily pad is the worst. <laughs> oh, also, you can try this level without the hover nozzle, just to make it more difficult. I have done everything in Mario Galaxy 1 and 2, except I haven't done the, like, really absolute final level of Galaxy 1, because I didn't know it was a thing, but I've done, I've gotten all the stars in both of them. None of them even come close to being this bad. There are some doozies. Everybody talks about the Purple Coin Toy Time Galaxy mission. That was not even that hard. Toy Time Galaxy Purple Coins, not that bad. One of, honestly, not even that bad compared to a lot of the other Purple Coin missions. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time in my life, I have gotten the freaking Delfino Lily Pad shine. And now I never have to do it again. It only took, like, half my lives. Oh, also, now that the flood is gone... Something else we can do. Uh, yeah, I think it's this guy. Shall I take you out to the airstrip? It's only ten coins. I don't have ten coins. Well, maybe next time. My price is always ten coins. We can grab ten coins. Oh, there's also a golden... Let's get the golden bird first. Let's get Turbo Nozzle. I love using Turbo Nozzle whenever I can. Like, it's the worst nozzle, but it is really fun to use. Honestly, I'm not sure if I ever knew there was a golden bird out this way. I thought the only one was in Noki Bay. And where is that shine gonna go? Wow. It goes way over there for absolutely no reason. Let's see if we can get over there without the hover nozzle. I think we can. Thanks for jumping, bro. No, Mario, that's not the way I told you to go. Stupid spin jump and it's an annoying controls. Let me try. You know what? Let's do it. No! Doggone it! Why is it like, oh, you're you fully charged while you were in the air? Oh, you don't go anywhere. It's very stupid. No! Oh! Supposed to be okay. Forget this. I'm getting rocket nozzle.
There we go, at last. A very, very rare case of grabbing the shine from the golden bird is harder than spraying the golden bird. I don't know why they made the shine sprite spawn so freaking far away. It's just weird. I need to find some coins. I need to get 10 coins so I can go to the airport again. I don't know about you, but if someone sprayed water through my open window, I would not be giving them money. I would be calling the police. Or do you want to throw Jane Whippersnapper Kids myself? There are coins under here in the manhole area. I can grab those. Oh, there we go. Well, that's just perfect. Yeah, realistic realistically, I wouldn't be calling the police unless they're doing it, like, continually. And I didn't want to bother do dealing with it myself. Shall I take you out to the airstrip? Yes, please. To the sea! Don't expect any sea shanties from this, Captain. Aww. <laughs> Yay, we get to go back to the tutorial area where look at all them coins. I should have brought Turbo Nozzle. Oh, no, I shouldn't have because here we go. One of the very rare things that Turbo Nozzle is used for. Alright, let's mine ourselves up. Let's line ourselves up. Click the eight red coins. Uh oh. oh <laughs> I guess we'll work on that later. <laughs> This is the way to get 100 coins in Delfino Plaza, by the way. I passed a nice- Oh, I know there are blue coins here. I'm focusing more on the red coins. There are also two M's here. Oh, those just give regular coins, though. I thought those gave blue coins. Yeah, there's a blue co there's a blue coin in that ice block. <laughs> Yahoo! Back to the airport. I think that's the only shine sprite in the airport. Or the airstrip. And we still have 89 coins. <laughs> Beautiful. Just jump out of the manhole, doofus.
I need someone from the open window to give me a dollar. Yeah! All the way back on that platform over there. But how will we reach it quickly? Did someone say, quickly? <laughs> Um, great job jumping when I told you to. No, Mario! You dumb butt. I'm pretty sure Turbo Nozzle can get up there as well if Mario stops being a jack butt. Okay, maybe it's just too high for that. Great. Turbo Nozzle for the lose, yet again. Stupid Pianta! There we go! Doodle-doo! -doo. 